It's Monday, October the 9th, and this is my uh, sixth update for our members in the 11 Catholic Dioceses. Voting is currently underway in protected action ballots. The ballot is conducted by the Australian Electoral Commission, the people who run federal elections. So questions about voting papers and the ballot procedure itself have to be addressed to the AEC. Most of you should have received voting papers during the school holidays, and many of you would have got an SMS from us at about 5pm yesterday afternoon. I apologise for disturbing your break, but we believe your participation in this ballot is very important. More than 500 schools are participating in postal ballots, and you would have received two sets of voting papers. One for an executive election where you're asked to vote for candidates, and another, which is the one I'm talking about today, where you're asked to vote yes or no to three questions. In some places, the ballot will actually be held at school. These are called attendance ballots. There are 69 of them being held over the next 10 days. 12 of them are being held today. Regardless of the type of ballot, it's extremely important that all members cast a vote. You cannot leave it to others. A majority of members in each workplace have to participate, have to cast a vote for it to be valid. Do not leave it to others. And I urge you to support protected action and to vote yes for each of the three questions. If you're part of the postal ballot, ask yourself this question. Have you voted and sent your ballot papers back? Posts can be delayed and these votes must be received by the AEC by Friday of next week. If you're having an attendance ballot, the ballot will be held between 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. So get yourself organised to make sure that you can attend and cast your vote. Remember, decisions are made by those who participate. Don't leave it to others and don't delay. Show up, cast your vote or post your ballot back today. Thank you for listening.